<laughs> you want the truth? I'm exhausted. I'm tired. The past few weeks, trying to balance life, physical health, and mental health has just felt like a trip up a steep mountain full of jagged, sharp rocks. And for some reason, the Tourette's is, um, man, it is ramped up a notch. <laughs> I'm ticking like crazy uh, vocal ticks. I think, I think that it's stress and um, exhaustion because I'm not sleeping super great. Sometimes getting three, four hours of sleep at night, not for lack of trying. <laughs> <laughs> My job requires me to be in front of a computer um, talking on the phone, and I'm um, my cube sits in between other cubes of people doing the same thing, and so I have to try to suppress my tics, especially when they're this bad because they're loud and they are uh, distracting. Um, so I have to not only pour my mental capacities into doing my job, but I'm pouring it into trying to suppress ticking. So by the end of the day, I'm brained out. I can brain no more. Tonight, my wife, Sarah, she picks up a couple part-time shifts at Starbucks a week. So she's picking up a shift tonight. I'm at home with all three kiddos by myself. And in a thoroughly depleted state, um, I'm having a really difficult time. <laughs> 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 I feel like I'm out of breath. What can you do? We just we just power through, right? And try to find a way to make it work. Maybe there is something that I could latch on to to help. I haven't found that yet. I'm working on finding that. But for the moment, really, I'm really struggling, you guys. I wanna be able to give the best of me to my family. I want to be able to carry as much of the load of life as I can. And I, I think I'm learning the hard way that when I try to heft it all, uh, <clears throat> when I try to heft it all, it doesn't work. This is one of the reasons we started this channel. Um, not. We want, we, I started it to capture memories and I started it to have open and honest dialogue about initially what it's like to parent ADHD while one of those parents myself has ADHD um, and I didn't really go into the side of Tourette's before mostly because it, it's usually, usually not a big issue. Um, I've never taken medication for it, but lately it's been getting worse and worse and worse to the point where it is starting to affect me. I, I'm not quite sure what to do about it yet. So, one of my greatest fears is that my kids would have to battle through a more extreme scenario. Um, and I know that other people with Tourette's who have a more extreme case than even my own. Um, they live happy lives and they learn how to, to deal with uh, ticks and they learn how to, to manage those things. I, ju I just don't want them to have to deal with this. 
So right now, I'm going to go sit down and I'm going to read a story to my kids. And in that time, I'm going to try to bring myself back to a more calm state. Because when I get overwhelmed like this, when I feel anxious, when I've been sitting on the edge of panic all day, I got to slow my roll. I got to find those things that help me slow my roll. And I think that sitting down with them tonight just to just to love on them and kind of let them love on me a little bit, if I'm honest, um, is going to be really helpful. What are your thoughts? <laughs> If there's something you're in the midst of, um, we want to encourage you. Um, we love that. We've had a couple people who have posted some comments on some of the other videos, and it brings us an immense amount of joy just to talk with you. We're not going to be able to offer great input all the time, but we're really good at listening, and we can relate to a lot of what, what you guys are going through. Um, you know, hit, hit us up in the comments. You can find me on Instagram at that dad Zach. Um, you can find Sarah at Sarah Jane Trandem. I'll post um, our, our uh, SNs, our screen names in the comment in the description. Come find us, shoot us a message on Instagram and just start a conversation. We would love to converse with you. Just get to know you, hear your story. What are you going through? What challenges have you faced? Maybe you're someone who, who's been through a lot of this or has more knowledge and wisdom than we do um, goodness knows we would love to hear from you we just appreciate you guys and I want to thank you for allowing me to be vulnerable frankly I didn't want to but this is also an outlet for me and I think it's good for me to vent a little bit I'm gonna go read some stories to my kids get them tucked in for the night and then um, kick back myself you guys are awesome. Love you. Thanks for being a part of the fam, and we'll see you again soon. Peace.